Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, man. On my way to work. Let me ask y'all a question, man. I just saw Tiggs' video where he basically put out a great video saying that a drone was spotted flying over the Atlanta Falcons practice yesterday. And apparently the Falcons had the drone taken down and they found the person that was uh, flying the drone. Um, okay. Here we go again. Now, let me ask y'all this. Why should I watch this fucking Super Bowl when you find out about this? I know somebody going to say, well, how you know it was the Patriots? How you know it wasn't the Patriots? I mean, look, I'm sorry, man. The Patriots are guilty by association, guilty by pattern, guilty by history of cheating. And I feel bad for the Atlanta Falcon fans because if they lose this game, they have a legitimate gripe against the Patriots. I hope y'all, to the Falcon fans, I'm praying that Matt Ryan gets this done. I, I, I really am. I want more than anything for the Falcons to win this Super Bowl. But when you hear about this shit, you just start saying, damn, here we go again. The fix is in. You know, this is not going to be a legitimate Super Bowl once again. Just like, I mean, to be honest with you, a lot of people think the last two Super Bowls, the one last year, was legitimate because Cam Newton played so out of place, he didn't even look like himself. And a lot of people think that Super Bowl was rigged. Now, the one the year before, you know, with the, with the Patriots and the Seahawks, where a lot of people thought that the Seahawks conspired not to give Marshawn Lynch the ball because if Marshawn Lynch scores that touchdown, more than likely he's the Super Bowl MVP. And they were so scared that he wouldn't talk to the media to where the Seahawks panic and they called that bonehead play. That was the most bonehead play i ever seen in my life. I mean, the Seahawks had it. And then I keep telling you guys, watch that Super Bowl. If Russell Wilson rolls out to the left, Marshawn Lynch is still wide open for a touchdown. That's one of them Super Bowls. It should it, it should stay it, it stays with you forever. Just like, you know, the Super Bowl with the Buffalo Bills and the New York Giants. You know, that game. Y'all yeah, know what I'm talking about, that fucking missed field goal. So it's one of them games, it, it stays with you for a while of shit based off how the fact that you lost. When you lose a game like that, it, it, it bothers you. It's just certain games, it just bother you forever because of the way you lose. Now, if you get blew out by like, you know, 30 points, then, hey, the other team was just clearly the better team, you know. They were just clearly better. But the Seahawks, they were a better team than the Patriots. And they should have won that Super Bowl. And like I said, the way they lost was just fucking pathetic. But then, this is what I'm talking about. The conspiracies surrounding the NFL. I mean, this drone shit, whether well, people are going to make a big deal out of it or not, it kind of makes you scratch your head. Here you have a team with a history of cheating. And then this shit happens. Now, if it turns out that a drone was spotted flying over, you know, the Patriots practice, then, hey, no harm, no foul. But I've yet to hear about that. So, therefore, I have to thrash the Patriots. Because it's easy to just say, hey, look, man, he go envelope. He go $50,000, you know, fly this drone over their uh, practice, over their practices at, uh, I think they were practicing at Rice University. You know, just, you know, just film it. Even if you, you know, even if you don't get nothing, even if they spot you, you know, no harm, no foul. You know, because more than likely... You got enough money to get bailed out if you are arrested. I don't even know if you can be arrested for something like that. So that's the point that I'm trying to make. So like I said, it's going, you know, I have this, um, 
this game on uh, DBR, you know, and I was going to watch it when I get home. But now, based off here in this news, I don't want to watch it. Because now, the drone inc incident alone makes this game suspect. And and I'm serious, to the Falcon fans, if y'all listen to this game, if you guys end up losing this game by yet another field goal, hey, you have every right to be suspicious of the Patriots because of their history. Now, me, myself, I'm rooting for the Falcons. I hope they destroy the Patriots. Nothing would make me more happier than to see that fucking cheating ass fraud of a quarterback, Tom Brady, be denied his fifth Super Bowl ring. I don't care if you if Patriots fans say I'm hating and, and all this type of shit and what proof do I have that Tom Brady's a cheater is fucking documented that he <laughs> that he's a cheater. He was suspended for cheating. So I mean, it's documented. The Patriots were were, were caught cheating. Like I say, Marshall Falk to this day is still sour about that uh, Super Bowl. So, Atlanta fans, if you guys end up losing this game, um, I, I, hey, you would be well with your right. But anyway, man, let me know what y'all think, man.